Reba's Marvelous Mysteries. It's Reba to the rescue. Come on along and solve this marvelous mystery with me. It was a beautiful spring day. The kind of day perfect for solving a mystery. Kyrie and I just love spring days. We were preparing to paint some pictures. Kyrie and I love art. As Kyrie and I prepared for a day of painting and fun, we had no idea that we were going to spend our spring day solving a mystery. The Bouncing Buddies were spending their day eating pizza, working in their office, and having a productive day. It was then that Bouncing Buddy Pink walked into the office and her face etched with worry and sadness. Her business journal was missing. It was very important to her. Her journal was one in which she wrote down all of her ideas and data. It was then that Pink called me to help her.
I told Pink that Kyrie and I would be happy to help her find her business journal. Pink was happy. With determination in our hearts, Kyrie and I got dressed in our detective swag, gathered our detective tools, and made our way to our friends, the Bouncing Buddies. Once Kyrie and I arrived at the office of the Bouncing Buddies, she asked Pink questions. Kyrie had her notebook and quickly began compiling information. Losing the business journal meant that Pink would not have access to all of the important plans and ideas she wrote. Kyrie was busy compiling all of the clues. I was busy gathering more information. As Detective Reba to the rescue and Detective Kyrie, we were determined to find Pink's journal and began to list information that would help in solving the case. This was going to be a two magnifying glass case. As Kyrie and I investigated further, Kyrie and I made note of three important clues. The first clue that Kyrie noted was a page lying on the floor near the office entrance. That page matched the paper that was in Pink's journal. Kyrie and I took note of this important clue and shared this clue with the rest of the bouncing buddies. After some time, Kyrie and Blue noticed a pencil resting on Pink's desk, its tip worn down as if it had been used recently. After closer observation, this was the second clue that Kyrie took note of. Kyrie wrote down the two clues in her notebook.
After some time, Kyrie and I did some searching around the office and gathered our third clue in this case. The books on Pink's desk looked a bit uneven. They were not meeting the desk. It appeared as if there was something under those books. This third clue was huge. Kyrie and I had all of the clues and we were about to break open this case. Yellow pointed us towards Pink's desk. Yellow respectfully pointed out to Pink that her desk was a bit messy. Pink agreed. She had books stacked on her desk. Her supplies looked as if they had just been thrown on the desk. They were not organized or neat. Kyrie removed some of the books off Pink's desk. After the removal of those books, Kyrie was able to see the missing business journal. The missing journal was covered under those books. Excitedly, the bouncing buddies gathered around Pink's desk. Pink began rejoicing after locating her business journal. She also remembered that she took a phone call yesterday at her desk. She further remembered that she was writing in her business journal and left her journal underneath that pile of books on her desk. The mystery of the missing journal was solved. It had never been taken or stolen at all. We were happy to piece together what happened and solve this case. With the journal safely located, Pink and the other bouncing buddies celebrated the victory. Orange treated everyone to a pizza, salad, and sandwich lunch. It was to Pink's advantage to call on me and Kyrie. Because Kyrie and I always get to the bottom 
of each case that we receive. As they waved goodbye to Detective Reba to the rescue and Detective Kyrie, the bouncing buddies knew that no mystery was too challenging for them to solve together. With friendship and perseverance, they could overcome any obstacle that came their way. So, the next time you find something missing or just not adding up and you need detectives, call on me and Kyrie, Reba's Marvelous Mysteries, Case Solved. Cheers for another solved mystery. Cheers for a neat and orderly workspace. Cheers for those bouncing buddies the best friends a pair of detectives could ask for.